So, after dropping 52 points in our last game, we are potentially on our way to setting a season record for rookies and having the most total points scored in a season. But today, we will be going up against one of the league's best players, Nikola Jokic. And after sweeping the Lakers in the Western Conference Finals a year ago, the Lake Show's looking for revenge, and I'm looking to follow through and get this dub. And with that being said, I don't think there's need for much talk. We're going to come out here and I set our dominance early up against these Denver Nuggets, man. We trying to go crazy? AD win this tip, my boy. They start off the game getting the ball to Jokic and let him go straight to work. AD's defending the paint great as Jokic is kicking it out, grabbing another rebound and putting it back up for the bucket. We need everybody going early. Cam Reddish is open at the wing for a wide open three as he gets it to go. And we're going to have to play good team defense, trapping Jamal Murray in the paint. And I can't leave Michael Porter Jr. open for those threes because just because he missed it this time doesn't mean he'll miss it forever. We push it in transition. I go behind the back, patiently setting up a mid-range bucket to go. Now, just because we're off to a good start, that does not mean Jokic is going to go away at all. And this is why Jokic Jokic is tough to guard. Pick and roll. Jokic gets the ball at the free throw line. Pull up for the jumper and it's good. We come back on the offensive end. Pick and roll with LeBron and AD. And I told you it's money. LeBron drives to the paint. I pop out to the wing. LeBron kicks it to me and I'm pulling for deep. Bang! Like I said, we do need to play great team defense. As I'm stopping Michael Porter Jr. here, he's kicking the ball to Jamal Murray in the corner and he's pulling the tray ball for the bucket. The game is pretty close, so I kick it out to Bron. Iso with Aaron Gordon on Bron, he gets downhill for the layup. Like I said in the beginning, good team defense. Jokic tries to post me up and I can't give him exactly what he wants. I'm backing up, we double him. He kicks out to the wing, Jamal Murray kicks to the corner and Michael Porter Jr. is not hitting in this first quarter. We get out in transition, I got a baby on me, Euro stepping Jamal Murray as I get the bucket to go. 16 to 15 is the score. Pick and roll with Jamal Murray and Jokic. Jamal's getting downhill, getting trapped in the low block. Michael Porter Jr. wide open again and he misses it. I'm out in transition. I got Aaron Gordon on me. Tweening, low pickup through the lane, getting straight to the right hand side for the bucket. Jamal Murray and Jokic pick and roll at the top of the three point line. Getting it down to Jokic. Jokic steps back and does a sombor shuffle for the bucket. It's still a very close game in the first quarter. So AR, I'm underneath this screen. I'm patiently reading the defense he's not coming up so i pull up with a mid-range jumper to go and this is where we're going to start having problems if jamal murray keeps curling up to the wing and pulling it for the tray rock and hitting it we're gonna have a long day guarding these dudes the denver nuggets defensively is a great team so i'm gonna need to get this switch and iso Jokic. i get to the mid-range pull up and get this nasty assist to christian wood we're playing great so far but they're still up by four we need to play good defense and get out in transition i'm getting a block here getting out in transition getting the ball from that man jared vanderbilt i got babies on me getting straight to the rack and yeah, I smoked the layup. But hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Before you get on me, I stopped the transition, getting a steal here, going straight to the wing, pull up for the three, and you already know it's money. Like I said, just give me a second. We're playing great so far, but they're still up by one, so we most definitely need to get stops. Reggie Jackson's going downhill, mid-range pull up, and he's missing it. Jokic is getting the rebound, putting it back up, and then he goes, does this clap jog away like, this. What, what is this, Jokic? After that little dumb Jokic celly, I knew I had to get to my bag. I get the ball at the top of the key, call for a screen, go straight to the left, they still plan me to drop, turn around, fader, and you already know it's green. They're still up by three, so I almost definitely want to tie this score up. I get the ball, run a set for that man D'Angelo Russell. He's at the top of the three, pull up for the trade ball, and you know it's money. We're all knotted up at 38 even, trying to double team Jokic. Kicks it out for the mid-range pull. Brick. I'm getting out in transition. I need this rock, man. Grabbing the ball, pump fake, driving left, spin back, right hand lay. Oh my gosh, I'm getting to it. And after that bucket, I look over to the bench, and coach tells me I'm two points away from getting that record. So I'm trying to make sure to do whatever I can to get a stop to keep this lead. They're trying to run a set for Justin Holiday, and I'm on top of it. Curls to the top of the three, bricks it. I'm out in transition, and I need this rock. I need to get this bucket. Iso, behind the back, snatch back, step back, pull up for the three, and you already know it's a bucket. And with that bucket there, I have officially broken the record for most points in the season by a rookie. Got the rock again. I'm trying to go straight to work, get straight busy. Call the screen, go straight through it, pull up at the top of the key for the mid-range bucket and you know it's green at this point we're rolling we're getting plenty of stops on defense they can't make a bucket at all the lid is just tight on the rim i get the rebound going straight in transition tweening going straight downhill euro stepping and they gotta foul me and you already know once we get to this charity stripe this free throw line we don't miss our free throws we might miss here and there but it's not as much as we making these things we don't miss these man you already know these free throws is easy money they're free points you gotta make these free throws so we're gonna come in here breathe for a second get this bucket and get back on transition get on defense man you feel me 
So we just go on this 12-0 run, and this man Jokic isn't having it. He gets straight to the paint, getting to work, pump faking, getting to the floater for the bucket. And with a team like the Nuggets, man, they are a great team. So I can't just beat them by myself. I got to get my guys going. I got 29 points in the second quarter. Let's get LeBron and AD involved. And that's exactly what I do. I get the ball at the top of the three, get an on ball screen from that man LeBron, told him to fade, kick him to the three-point. He's pulling from the deep three, and you know it's a bucket. Denver really can't get it going. Leaving KCP wide open for three, daring him to make it as he bricks it. I'm getting the ball, pushing the ball in transition, getting the on ball screen from that man D'Lo. I want the switch to Jamal. Go straight downhill. Euro step. He's too little. That man, Javante, is nice. I'm telling you. Jamal Murray does a great job driving, penetrating the defense, kicking it out to KCP, and KCP knocks down a three. Jamal Murray again, dribble penetration, drawing the double, and kicking it for a wide open KCP as he's not capitalizing off of it. Let me see the ball. I know I got a little bodies down there. Behind, go straight downhill, getting to a strong finish at the basket against Aaron Gordon. If Denver's going to stay in this game, they got to get some shots going down for him, especially when they get wide open. They were in a pick and pop with that man, Michael Porter Jr., as he's wide open for the three ball and this goes in and now the nuggets are scoring i gotta get brown the ball pick and roll with lebron and i'm throwing him the bomb. that man brown is 39 years old still jumping out the gym head above the rim hey man go feed that man that's the king like i said i'm feeding my teammates ad i am not leaving you left out i'm not leaving you left out for every point that we put on the board it seemed like the nuggets was actually trying to match it Jamal Murray gets the ball at the top of the key, goes straight downhill on D'Angelo Russell, getting to a nice scoop lay. As they're getting that bucket, I need to get Bron some more points, man. Drawing the double team off the pick and pop. Bron's wide open. He's pulling the tray ball. Hey, man, Mike Malone calling the timeout, regrouping his squad, man. It's 10-point deficit. As a unit, we are playing great Lakers defense. They're running the pick and roll. KCP gives it to Jokic. Jokic kicks it back. I get the block on the defensive end. Now we're in transition. I'm pushing it. Going straight downhill, getting an easy lay on Michael Porter Jr. We're back on defense, and they still can't seem to score. Jamal Murray's putting up a dumb three. So we're getting down in transition. I'm getting a screen from that man, Anthony Davis. Roll to the rack, and I feed him this nice bounce pass for the dunk. And at this point, we are showing our dominance. We are up to a 19-point lead up against the Denver Nuggets, and we haven't had a Jokic sighting yet, but I might have spoke too soon. The Joker's a two-time MVP. He gets it down in the paint. I'm trying to help AD. You already know I'm trying to cheat a little bit, and he reads it. Gets it to Michael Porter Jr. Michael Porter Jr. is knocking down the three. Hey, man, when Jokic is passing a ball like that, you got to stay home and I gotta learn that but I want Jokic to know that I got the most dominant big man in the game on my squad after that bucket I get this screen from AD and I want him to set the tone rolls to that rack I'm throwing the lob and AD slamming it on Jokic yeah Jokic that man AD is him he's him don't jump with him you barely can dunk yourself he will dunk you into the rim with three seconds left on the shot clock Jokic goes straight downhill straight to the paint for a nice lay with the Nuggets getting back into the game, I'm trying to keep our lead. I get a screen from AD, drawing the double, kicking it to D'Lo as he's wide open in the corner for the tray ball. And at this point, I'm passing the ball better than Jokic. I got 11 assists and it's only the third quarter. But the Nuggets wouldn't be down for long. Jamal Murray, dribble penetration, drawing the double, kicking it out. He's great at that. KCP hitting the three. And this might be where I'm showing my DPOY candidacy. We're back on offense and we're still up by 10. We try, gotta try to score. LeBron throws the ball, turns it over, and I'm chasing KCP down. I'm not not letting him score after that chase down block i was on their neck the whole rest of the game see every time i touched the ball they were going to send the double especially through the screen they no more playing me in drop so i throw ad the lob like i said every time i touch the ball they're sending the double i'm just going to find a wide open man as lebron's wide open in the corner for the three ball like i said they can't keep up with me crossing over going straight through the screen drawing the double kicking it to ad as he's rolling to the rim the 30 seconds left in the third quarter we're up by a wide margin i fall asleep on defense jamal murray curls up to the top of the three Pulls up for the tray and hits it. You know I'm trying to get to my buckets. AD set this screen. I'm going behind the back to snake it. Get double teamed again. Kick it to AD for the mid-range pull up in the corner. And this is where I just make a boneheaded decision on defense. I'm trying to cheat just so Jokic does not get an easy rim run to the paint. I step down just a little too far and leave KCP wide open for a three. At this point, we got a 17-point lead in the fourth quarter. And if we want to keep that lead, we got to play very sound defense and not turn the ball over on offense. Being patient on offense and playing very soundly as a team on defense is going to be very important for us to get this dub. They pull up a dumb shot, grab the rebound, and we out in transition. Like I said, we need to be patient. We don't need to rush a bucket. So I call for the screen from LeBron. He's rolling to the rim. I draw the double again, and I throw the lob. 
We're playing great as a team. Jokic pick and rolls are usually unstoppable, but we're showing bodies and getting him very frustrated in the paint as he's missing another floater. We're getting in transition. Bron's kicking me the ball. I'm crossing over. He's cutting to the rack, and I'm throwing him another alley-oop. We're up 19, and I'm feeling great. There's five minutes left in the game, and we're playing great defense. And at this point, I already have 20 assists, broke the rookie scoring record, and I'm trying to set the tone to these Nuggets that they're not sweeping us ever again. And the best way I could do that, you'll see this next play. Austin Reeves ends up playing great defense on Jamal Murray, gets a steal, kicks it to me for the fast break. I'm going straight down to the pain. You know I'm rising. Ah! Let's go home. Let's go home. We send them back to Denver. Sending them back to Denver. We can't wait to see you on the playoffs. They're still double teaming me on offense. I don't know why. I kick it straight to LeBron. LeBron kicks it back to me. I get doubled. I kick it to the corner for that man AR to hit the green bean in the corner. If this man Jokic just started playing like this from the beginning of the game, they would have had a lot more points on the board. Post fade from that man Jokic, we're still going crazy. LeBron set that screen. I'm throwing you the oop and they're not guarding him. They're not guarding him. He's 39. He should not be jumping like that. Do you see how high this man is jumping? This man is 39. That's crazy. We finished the game 121 to 98, man. Completely blowing out the Nuggets. That man, Vontae, had a great day. 41 points, 8 rebounds, 24 assists, 2 steals, 3 blocks. Shot bad from the 3-point line. A little bit under 40% but great from the field. That man LeBron had 26, AD had 24, hey, Jamal Murray had 25, Jokic had 24, and KCP had 23, man. Hey, man, we had a great game against these Denver Nuggets, and I can't wait to see them in the playoffs, man. That, that man Vontae had a special day, broke the rookie scoring record, had 24 assists in the game, out-assisted Jokic. We out-assisted Jokic, one of the best, if not the best passer in the game. Amen. And like I always say, bro, don't ever ask me if I'm on Hall of Fame. You should already know I'm on Hall of Fame. Hey, man, it's proof right there. Proof in the pudding, bro. It's just, Vontae's just like that, bro. He just like that. If y'all like that video, please make sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all for showing love on the last video. I'm going to be pumping these my career videos out. Hey, Madden videos is on the way too, man. Till next time, love y'all. See, look, Hall of Fame difficulty, sell it right there. I'm just saying, Hall of Fame difficulty verification right there. Hey, man, love y'all. Till next time, peace. Congratulations on breaking the rookie scoring record. You've been an immediate offensive force in a league where some players believe a rookie should take a back seat to veterans. Have you ever worried about ruffling feathers? Um, no, winning is the ultimate goal, right? And if I can help a team achieve that by scoring points, then that's what I'm going to do. Um, I respect the experience and wisdom of the veterans, for sure, who have come before me. But every player has a role to play in order for us to achieve our goals. Um, if that means being an offensive force and helping the team win games, then that's what I'll do, regardless of any feathers I might ruffle. Um, I'm here to win, not to concern myself with the veteran players fragile ego.